Always a special day on the calendar. Champions League final day, and it's a privilege to be bringing the game to you. My name's Derek Ray, joined for commentary by Lee Dixon. The atmosphere is building to fever pitch just minutes away from kickoff time. It's Milan versus Barcelona. Good evening. What a pleasure it is to be here with you, Derek, sitting over this magnificent stadium with arguably the best two teams, well, obviously the best two teams in this competition this year because they're in the final. And what a final we've got. The pitch looks fantastic. The crowd are expecting. There's the trophy just sitting there and the players are in the tunnel just about to do what they do best, go out and play and entertain us. And Milan's lineup looks like this. If you like wingers, you'll love this league. Yeah, absolutely. I love to watch a winger play, especially with pace and power. The central strike will stay more or less in front of the goal. The support will be provided by the three central midfield players. The back four is pretty conventional, but the fullbacks will be asked to support from behind. Well, this is what we think for Barcelona. Marc Andre Ter Stegen starts in goal. Clément Longley plays alongside Piquet in the middle of the defence. And up front, leading the line, is Antoine Griezmann. Messi. Messi. Griezmann! Great save following the close range effort. Look how close he gets to the goalkeeper. It's a really, really good save in the end. Played into the set. Fine goalkeeping to push that away. Beautifully timed. And they'll have to throw it back in play. It is the game that the world truly focuses on. The Champions League final. Only two teams left in the quest for European glory. Who's it going to be tonight, Lee? Well, it's a toss of a coin for me. It's a really big night for everybody. All that hard work leading up to pre-season training, going through your domestic league, playing Champions League on and off, the winter break, all of that culminates in tonight. Very, very big night for everybody concerned. Supporters, but most so the players. They have to stay. But... Messi! Goalkeeping of the very highest order. Oh, it was a great shot as well. Great shot, great save. And now the delivery. Well, he couldn't quite keep the header down. Well, it was the pace on the cross. Sometimes with that much power on the cross, just cushioning it, otherwise it goes over. It's been well nigh impossible to escape all the news stories surrounding him ahead of the game. And the reports have been confirmed. He's decided to end what has been a brilliant career at the end of this season. A huge loss for the club, you've got to say, Lee. Well, how do you feel that cut, Derek? Such a great player. And attempting the through ball. Keeper's contribution, but what next? It might be on for them. Well, he wasn't messing around with the clearance. That's a very impressive piece of defending. Well, what a stop that was, Derek, to keep it all square. Still don't know how he kept that one out. Well, there are the stats, Derek. Barca controlling possession over the last 15 minutes. They really have put the pressure on. You feel their play deserves a goal, but will they get one? They need to just be a little bit better, a little bit more clinical. There's a slide draw pass. Just drifted into the illegal position, offside, in the opinion of the officials. Messi. Cross-fired over. Well, he failed to get it away properly. James Rodriguez. It's with Ibrahimovic. They don't normally need a second invitation to give it... Well, they would have been in a decent position there, but offside. Oh, what a wasted opportunity that is. Sergio Busquets. Messi. In full control of the ball here. Will he find the net? A goal for Barcelona. The Blaugrana out in front in the Champions League final. So how important will that be for Barcelona to get their noses in front? That remains to be seen. Well, Derek, this is why coaches tell you to stop the cross from coming in. But they didn't get tight enough and were punished for it. Underway again with Barcelona in the lead. Real 
difficulty keeping the ball. Well, they've jumped in front, Lee. That's the most important thing. Your assessment so far? Well, it's all going well for Barcelona. Just, it's tight. Control of the ball is key when a game's like this. They have the players to do it for sure, though. But they'll be the happier of the two teams at half-time. Wagge. Lionel Messi. Well, this might pay dividends. Fed over towards the back post. Well, it might still work out for them. And a pretty straightforward stop for the goalkeeper there. Yeah, weak shot, straight at him, no problem for the goalie. It's with Vinicius Junior. We've had the official word. There will be a minimum of two added minutes. Ibrahimovic. James. Excellent vision. That is when your goalkeeper is worth his weight in goal. Well, he's earned his wages, hasn't he? He was in position. He had his focus. What a save. A strong glove on the ball from the keeper. Half time then. And we're sorry for the pause and the... Into the second half then, in this battle for Champions League glory. Jordi Alba. Frankie de Jong. Zane has it. Griezmann. They could pick out a teammate. Vinicius Junior. Given away by the Rossoneri. Griezmann, De Jong, will it be? Well, he'd be disappointed if he didn't take that one cleanly. The ball with James Rodriguez. Teo Hernandez now. Rodriguez. Vinicius Junior. Happy to pass the ball, but remaining patient. Wagge. De Jong. Messi. Griezmann. De Jong. Sané. Straight down the throat of the opposition. Messi. Griezmann. And putting his body on the line. It's with Vinicius Junior, Zlatan Ibrahimovic. Strongly in, PK. Frankie de Jong. Gliding through the gears. Messi. Wagge. PK with it. Sergio Busquets. Artur. Now Busquets. Sané. Good ball movement and a decent position here for Barcelona. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. Tonali with it. James Rodriguez. Playing with purpose and control. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Cutting the ball back. Fine reaction save from the goalkeeper. Goalkeeping at his best. Really, really top draw. They decided that now is the time to go to the bench. And over comes the corner. Well, not quite. Cassier. Paqueta. Cassier. It looks promising. It's a perfect challenge. Teo Hernandez. 
Kessier. Agueta. Kessier has it. Chance to attack using width. Options in the centre. Draws it back. Ibrahimovic. And thwarting his opponent in the nick of time. Dembele. Jordi Alba. Well, they're quite content to knock it around inside their own half. Barca making progress. What can they do from this position? Well, Derek, look at those Milan possession stats over the last 15 minutes. Pretty good. And you can sense the equaliser is coming as long as they keep creating the chances they've done. Time is very much of the essence, though. Making progress. Well, visionary passing. Well, just couldn't keep himself onside. Paqueta, Kessier, Lucas Paqueta, Tonali with it, Chiesa, and will it be the leveller? Oh, can you get your heads around this? Just when we thought it might be done and dusted, it's level again. Well, the fans were starting to think it was over, not now, another twist maybe, Derek. Well, we can take another look at this. There's nothing much the keeper can do. Close range finish, really good play, and he doesn't miss from there. So, a level contest. 1-1. Only five minutes left for play, and tension galore with the teams locked together. Possession changes hands, the interception there. Piquet with it. No nonsense clearance. Paqueta. Federico Chiesa. Milan still on the attack and the game's waning moments. Still level. The electronic board has been held aloft. Two additional minutes here. Artur. Oh, lovely weighted ball. They might be in. Messi. Busquets. Griezmann! Well, how about that? Barcelona forge ahead in the Champions League final with time running out. Well, here we can see Derek from this better angle. It's all about the technique. When you're volleying a ball, it's all about timing. Let it get to the right place for your foot to make the connection. And there you go, in the back of the net. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it? And the final whistle, the cup issue is settled. A story of one side celebrating and the other distraught. And Lee, memories are being made. Yeah, absolutely. It doesn't matter.